morning. Um, we're in Southern Leyte, uh, specifically Barangay Sangahon in uh, Malitbog. Uh, I'm on a route that will take me around 54, 55 kilometers uh, through the interiors of Southern Leyte. Uh, I'm on the steeper parts of the route right now. I have about still 6% gradient, but I feel heavy. <sighs> so I've come to a crest. Uh, we are around 187 meters above sea level. It's just resting to soak in the view. Uh, there's another massive climb up ahead. Um, I'll show you. Look. From here, there, and behind those mountains. Uh, I'll end up in Masin City today. Um, I'm estimating around three hours for this ride. We'll see if it's actually three hours. <laughs> Actually, this isn't my first time here. Um, when I was 19, I tried this route uh, on my mountain bike. Big fat 2.4 tires uh, on my Scott Hardtail. Barely made it. Uh, tried it again yesterday, but it rained. And now I'm here, trying it again. I just made it up the top of the mountain. Um, these mountains are actually traversing from north to south and I'm just cutting through it. I should have a map somewhere on the screen. Uh, and now I'm on a gravel path. Didn't expect this. Uh, Strava didn't say there would be gravel. <laughs> um, anyway, this is downhill from here. And I don't want to film that because I have to focus, uh, especially that it's on a dirt road. Uh, see you at the bottom. Morning, Padung Maasin. Magawas ito Maasin. Okay, salamat. I think my friends Kawayan and Bernie will like this. <laughs> Look at this gravel path. Very, very nice. Oh shit, uphill. Uh. Oops, wrong gear. Let's hike the bike. Uh, part of the reason why I'm doing this ride is because it's been three months. It's Today is March 6th. Um, it's almost three months since uh, Typhoon Adet hit. Um, if you remember, uh, the first gravel ride I did in this area uh, was um, just the day after Adet, where I was rushing to check on my parents, my family, friends, and uh, loved ones. Hey guys, it's um, Friday, 17th of December, uh, 2021. Uh, typhoon that just hit our region last night. We have no power. Uh, we don't have um, telecommunications. Uh, the storm hit uh, southern Leyte around 3, 4 p.m. yesterday where my parents are. And I haven't been in contact with them since then. And I'm getting worried. So I'm going to drive down and check how they are. Um, I'm bringing a few supplies with me, water, food, uh, medicines. Uh, I'll also probably take the bike just in case. Just in case I don't, I mean the roads aren't passable. Um, I'm doing this to cap off uh, the relief operations that 
me and my friends have been doing uh, the past three months uh, so yeah I'm just seeing uh, how things are and and mostly it's been positive uh, things are a, little, are a little more stable now oh there's a cow look there's a cow As I was saying earlier, uh, this gravel ride is to cap off um, the relief operations we've been doing for the past three months. Uh, and things are a little more stable now. Um, well, obviously, like it's a lot greener than what it used to be a few months ago. And it started to rain. Snap. Um, Shout out to Coach Jedi, our nutritionist. Coach, I hope you're happy that I'm just taking a banana and not some power gel. So this, this last uh, relief op is to hand out um, solar lights to several more people, um, most especially the farmers, because personally, I would love for them to be able to stand back up and, and be able to their, to do their work because food is an essential uh, part of this whole um, relief operation uh, so last night we were able to hand out those solar lights from Atlas and uh, Empowered um, I should have some clips somewhere and in Southern Leyte to to give another batch of solar lights to a few more people so let's go okay okay nako and with that um, I wish to cap off my relief operation um, here in the south uh, it's been one hell of a roller coaster um, once again I'm thankful and grateful uh, and forever indebted to your gratitude everyone who has helped out my friends uh, acquaintances even random strangers on the internet who have sent their well wishes cash and, and goods to help the people out here Maraming salamat. Padayon lang.